If you have not subscribed my channel, please subscribe by pressing subscribe icon. Also press the bell icon for the notification. You will get notification for my upcoming videos. Hello friends. In today's video we will see why the five sensors are fitted in the inverter split air conditioner how they work and where they are located so we will see and understand in normal air conditioners we have two sensors these two sensors are fitted in the indoor unit only but in inverter air conditioner we have five sensors two sensors as in the normal air conditioner fitted in the IDU and rest three are fitted in the ODU so first we will see how this room temperature sensor or air sensor works. It is located at the cooling coil and not touching to the cooling coil behind the filters and it senses the temperature of return air coming from the room and whatever the temperature we have set and it according to that it maintains the temperature according to the circuit. Next we have coil sensor, it is also known as a defrost sensor and it is located at the cooling coils and touching to the cooling coils. Whenever the temperature goes below 0 degree Celsius in a negative and the resistance of this sensor goes very high and it cut off the compressor and it shows a error code or a defrosting indication. Whenever again the temperature goes above the 0 degree Celsius, again it starts the compressor and it protects the compressor. Next we have discharge line sensor and discharge line sensor it is fitted in the ODU and it is fitted at the discharge line coming out from the compressor and whenever the temperature of the discharge line goes abnormal and very high and it cut off the compressor and shows error and go to the protection mode. So the, these sensors, additional sensor in inverter air conditioner, those are fitted in the ODU. It is for the additional protection of the unit. This uh, discharge line sensor is uh, having very high resistance. It is of 50 kilo ohm resistance and we require the melt clamp meter which is having at least 100 kilo ohm king range. Next we have the liquid line or condenser sensor. It is located at the end of the condenser and it senses the liquid refrigerant temperature. If the poor condens condensation will be there in the unit due to any reason uncleaned or dirty condenser or uh, fan motor not working, whenever the temperature will be abnormal then this sensor will protect the unit and there will be protection mode error as per the error code chart. This is the last fifth sensor. This is also fitted on the condenser but it is not touching to the condenser but outside of the condenser where the fan throws the hot air from the condenser to the atmosphere and if the ambient temperature it is abnormal it is very high because if the poor condensation will be there or very hot weather very hot air is passing through the sensor it will again go to the protection mode and the protection mode error will be there we have two types of sensors one is copper head and other is plastic head 
द कॉल सेंसर विच इज फिटेड इन द आई डी यू विद द कूलिंग कॉयल्स इट इज ऑफ कॉपर हैड एंड एयर सेंसर इट इज ऑफ अ प्लास्टिक हैड सो बोथ दीज आर नेगेटिव टेम्परेचर कॉफिशियंट वेन द टेम्परेचर विल बी हाई द रेजिस्टेंस विल बी लो सो अकॉर्डिंग टू द रेजिस्टेंस and it is fitted in the circuit it function according to the temperature because this is the thermistor sensor so for this we require 5 volt dc for the sensor to activate hope now you will be able to understand why the five sensors are there in the inverter split air conditioners for more information you may write comment thank you very much